bag, but I recently realized I buy a lot of Hermes. I love their bags. I like that they're quite classic and they don't date. Whereas if I buy more fashion bags, I feel like they date more. So I'd rather have that, which I think I'll be wearing literally in 20 years. Then I had a bit of a thing last year for the baby little Birkins and Kellys. I use that every day. That goes on the back of my pushchair. It fits just about everything in. And that one, I love the color. When I bought it, they put a twilly around it because obviously it will get really, really dirty and I've got to be careful with it. I'll be honest, I'm really scared to use it. I literally use it like this with my, because I'm scared that my jeans are gonna rub off on it. But the black, not so much. I'm not bothered, that just goes anywhere. I normally buy neutral color handbags because they go with everything. But you know, I do get a handbag with a pop of color because you always need a bit of color to brighten up something in the summer. And gold hardware, I love gold hardware because I wear gold jewelry. My favorite accessory is definitely this Hermes belt, which I found on Vestiaire Collective. I love Vestiaire Collective for secondhand things because I picked this up for about 300 pounds and I think they're thousands new. And also my black one I found on there. And I love those with a dress, just to belt a dress in the summer. Right, let me show you my shoes. So when we moved to London, I had to either choose a nursery for a second baby or a wardrobe. So I've had to put my clothes all over the place because the nursery won. So my shoes are here. My most recent shoe purchase was, or oh, two pairs actually, I'm really naughty. I got these from Balenciaga. I love their knife shoes this season. They're amazing. These are the mules. And I also bought those as well. But they go with everything. I don't really have a go-to brand for shoes. I like so many different brands. It depends on the season. I like Chanel for classics. I do love the slingbacks. And I like their ballet shoes also. I love Miu Miu. Also last, last season I loved Miu Miu. These are lovely. And I love to wear these dressed with just jeans. Like dress them down like some boyfriend jeans. I love Celine shoes. I really do love Celine shoes. So I love this kind of pointy. I live in the Gucci Prince Towns. So they are so comfortable. And these are Sherling. I think everyone thinks they're fur, and they because they originally did do them in fur. They did them in kangaroo fur, but um, they changed it. They've changed the whole thing, and now it's it is sheepskin. So I do love those. They're literally like wearing my slippers. I have them in pink velvet. I have the black leather and um, a red leather pair as well. I'm gonna get the black velvet next. If I'm honest, I'm in these every day. <laughs> My go-to boot shape at the moment seems to be a point. I'm looking around and everything's kind of pointy. I love these. I just got these from Dior this season. Kind of chewel, they're really lovely. These are also Dior. I love. Pointy, pointy. The best shoe bargain is very cool. I went into Marks and Spencer's with my mum yesterday and I saw these. And I love the Celine white leather um, boot, but I wouldn't pay that much for a white leather boot because I don't think I'd wear them very often. 35 pounds and I actually had 20% off. They're fab, really, really good. I've had to utilize every little bit of space, see me as we're in central London. So I had to put a wardrobe under the stairs. This is where all my jeans and my jumpers are down here and my blouses and all my shorter dresses. So I have everything kind of stashed away in here. One of my favorite high street brands is Marks and Spencers, but more for their basics. I love their cashmere jumpers. I think I would say 70% of these are just from Marks and Spencers. I just love, I mean, this one looks very silly and it's got the color blocking. And they're, they're not too expensive. So if they get eaten by moths, it's not the end of the world. If you ask me what I wore the most, I'm in the winter, it's M&S, cashmere jumper and jeans. So down here we have the Ganny knits that I know everyone has, but they're just so gorgeous. They're so cozy. I love it, I really, really love it. I, I wore this the other day actually with um, the Ganny skirt, you know, the polka dot skirt, and I thought it looked really, really pretty. Um, but jeans, just dressed down, I love, you know, like a great big chunky knit, even with these leather trousers, I guess, but dressed down. And the sleeves are really big, so you can't really put a coat over it. <laughs> so in the autumn winter, I, I really do just wear a chunky knit and 
a pair of jeans or a, th you know, a thin knit and a big coat. I want to be comfortable. I don't want to be running around all day, you know, in pain, <laughs> wearing heels. I don't like being overdressed. So I recently bought this. I'm absolutely in love with it. It's cashmere, it's Celine, it's their iconic piece. So it's every season, they never change it. It's oversized. I love that it's slouchy. It's got the drop sleeve. I just think it's effort effortlessly cool. So I'm very excited about this. I haven't worn it yet. But. So these are my jeans. I've been wearing my Vetmont jeans and Levi's. I love like vintage Levi's. So these are my absolute favorite, which I picked up for about 20 pounds. I mean, I'll either wear them with Prince Towns, like a pair of flat Gucci loafers, or if I'm going out, I might put them with like the Mew Mew little heels, like a kitten heel, like a mule or something. I love these with the Balenciaga. I had them on the other day. I'm a big fan of leather trousers or leggings. I recently just bought these ones from Joseph. I love the button. I like that they're wider and I've got quite a few pairs, but I also love the Oxblood, which is an alternative to black. Through here, I have some more clothes. This is my little weakness, my Chanel cupboard. I just love it. I love their jackets. I mean, you can see they're all black jackets and some of them are really old. This was the first one I got and that's from 2006. And they just never really date. That's the, again, that's from 2008. That's the little black jacket when they redid it. I would wear that with jeans, a white t-shirt, just dressed down and casual. Love that look. Great one for the summer. I love with the little crop, crop sleeves. It's very cute. Again, with jeans. You can throw it on over a little summer dress. One of the things I love more than anything in the world is that. And it's a jacket dress, but I wear that with tights, thick black tights when I go out in boots. My husband got me that for Christmas about four years ago. So that's my Chanel. <laughs> I love wearing dresses. I like wearing dresses in the summer. Just, it's so easy, isn't it? It's just one thing. You throw them on, you put them with a pair of sandals. It's kind of cool. I, I just find it very easy to wear a dress and comfortable. Um, and especially a longer one, because I don't love my legs. I'm obsessed with Vitakin. I really, really love Vitakin. I love the green. And I think I might wear this this winter, actually, over a polo neck with boots. And have a few. I prefer the longer ones. I, I also really do love dresses in winter. This is Resort. Um, and I actually think I'll wear this with like grainy high boots in the winter. So because I wear jeans and flats all winter, when I go out, I do like to get really quite dressed up. So I love the attic and the velvet. I got that last year, but they're doing it again. Such a lovely shape. I really love that. Last year I wore it with little socks, ankle socks, and then the pointed new muse, and my husband was just like, what are you wearing? But um, I still like the socks and shoes, but I'll probably just wear it with, with little boots or little shoes. But I do like getting dressed up when we go out. And I love coats. I do invest in coats. I do love to buy a really good coat. I probably buy one or two every winter. This Sherling number is from Chloe and I remember when it was in store and it was so expensive and I couldn't afford it and then I saw it on Vestiaire Collective for £600 and I snapped it up. It's so heavy but I love it. And then I have this which is also shearling, it's not fur. It's a Celine coat and I picked that up in Bista last year. I love going to Bista. I always go kind of September when they just get the autumn winter stuff in because they get it a little bit later than the stores. Um, so I run there to Celine and get, I got a coat this year and I got one, this one last year. And you can pick them up for a real bargain. They're great, I love this stuff. I also got this last year, this is a classic. They've done it again this year, I love a camel. It's, well, it's my only really, really classic, classic coat and I love that. I wore this over everything last winter because it's so oversized, you just chuck it over leather leggings, jeans, dresses, everything belted. This is my big investment this year. This is my Chanel coat and again it's oversized so it goes on over everything and it's navy blue. I love navy. I'm really into navy and it's just... I love it and I know I'm gonna have it for 